Hello and welcome to 2 Minute Design, I'm Dage and today we're gonna use the Puppet Warp tool to distort and warp specific image areas while leaving other areas intact. I've taken a photo of myself looking like a complete idiot and I've removed the background. First things first, let's convert this layer to a smart object in order to work non-destructively. Now go to Edit, Puppet Warp, check Show Mesh here and set the expansion to 0 pixels so that the outer edge of the mesh is exactly at the edge of the image. I think my mesh has not enough density, so I'll set the density here to more points. Great. Now uncheck show mesh and let the fun begin. I want to be able to adjust my arms position. I want them to be closer together. So I'm gonna add some pins to areas that I want to transform, like here and here, and to areas I want to anchor in place. I don't want my head to be moving at all, so I'll add a pin here and here, I'll then add another two here and obviously I don't want my feet to be moving so I'll add two more pins here okay now look what happens when I drag this pin wow that's awesome isn't it I'll click and drag this one as well and then hit enter see how easy that was and because we're working on a smart object we actually created a smart filter which is the puppet warp itself so you can turn it off and then turn it back on. You can also double click it to go back and edit the pins. Now let's say I want my hands to be overlapping. I'll simply add two pins, one on each hand, and then just move them just like that. As you can see, this pin is in front of that one. That's why I have one hand over the other. If I want it to be behind the other hand, I'll simply click to select this pin, and then up here I can change the pin depth and send it to back. You can also select one pin, hold down the shift key and select the other one and then move them at the same time. If you want to rotate a pin, just select it, position the cursor near to it, hold down alt or option and then click and drag to rotate. If you want to remove a pin, place the cursor directly over it and then hold down alt or option and click once. And that's it. Enjoy puppet warping. Okay, I just want you to take a picture of me just like that. And then in Adobe Photoshop, we add some pins to my hand and using the Puppet Warp tool, we'll make them closer together. Or we can save time and just take the picture with the correct angle.